I think this is right. Okay. I'm gonna try it this way. Uh, so us, my mom called and asked me after almost eight years, am I okay with my medication? I am a diabetic. Eight years decided to ask me about that. Could have lost my foot or something by now. By, by the way, if you're uh, if you don't know, diabetes will cause you to go blind and other complications, including losing a foot or both feet, that kind of thing. So, all right. I said no. I, I got that because you know Obamacare, basically, or you know, pretty much those kind of programs. And she was like, "Oh, I don't think so." I was like, "Yeah, that's the point." Um, kind of confused because the Republican Party aren't about Social Security or um, you know anything that's socialist, but. Uh, most of the people who are voting Republican are actually taking partaking in the socialist society thing. So I'm very confused. Uh, do the Republican Party think that they're the socialist or they do all the good things? Because I'm kind of realizing that Republicans fight against doing things that benefit the people all the time, like uh, Social Security. That's a big thing. Raising Social Security. No, we can't do that. Uh, food stamps. That's a socialist thing. Uh, universal health care. We can't do that either. Because, you know, universal health care is evil. You know, all this stuff is evil. But um, they always... But the people who are benefiting it... Yeah, I know. Shaky camera. Trying to, trying to hold it steady. But, but the people who are benefiting it are voting against their own benefits. I don't understand. Oh, I hope that's in an end. Um... All right. Anyway, so I mean, like, what, 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 what do, what does the Republican Party do for anybody ever? Like, everything they do is literally just talking points or the opposite of what anybody needs, including rich people. I mean, why do rich people think that they're winning when they don't get things that benefit everyone? I don't understand it. It's like. Raising a minimum wage st stabilizes our economy, although that hasn't been done since 1997, and the uh, Democrats misstepped that and told us that they raised it to 7.25 an hour from 7.25 an hour. And if you put in the comments 6.10, no, that was in that was before 1987. I was looking at the laminated poster for years, going, when are they going up on minimum wage? By uh, 2006, I was going. It's been almost 10 years at $7.25 an hour. My part-time job was $7.25 an hour at Papa John's, $4 while I was delivering, and my full-time job was $8 an hour after being there for a while. And it's above minimum wage, so they, that's, they said that was fair. They said if I work harder, I might get a raise. And they did finally rate, give me a raise up to $8.50 an hour because they had to start hiring people at a higher rate at $8 an hour, basically. But, I mean, $7.25 an hour has been around since 1997. And that's a big misstep. They have not, uh, Democrats have not had supermajority since 2008, since they lost it because of the, or, well, you know, the, uh, uh, election cycle, excuse me. So, I mean, that's because they sat here and told me and the rest of the population that was making minimum wage. Nah, we're not gonna raise the minimum wage which has caused us have instability. Why we had to bail out the rich people because if our system would crash because our system is based off of the majority of the population having a minimum wage that is affordable, uh, living, affordable living. But it hasn't happened since 1997. So we've had two bailouts. And what does the rich people do with it? Uh, another private jet job, big house. And that's it. Uh, stock buybacks and all those things. It doesn't mean anything to anybody. Doesn't really actually mean anything to anybody because they're not curing cancer and diabetes, heart disease with that. You can sit here and argue that uh, they've already got the cure for cancer and all that. They just don't let us have it. But then what happened to jobs? Jobs, cancer. Uh, the uh, owner of Apple. I mean, come on, seriously. This, 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 there's there's no argument you can make that it actually makes any sense. Uh, Democrats aren't doing the jobs as well as they should be. The Republicans are sitting here thinking that they're winning when they're screwing themselves and us, all of us. I mean, I'm like, I don't, I. 
and they're, and they're sitting here talking about, well, no, they're the ones that did sit here and uh, got your medication. It's like, how? that's the opposite of what the Republican Party are about. They're literally about pulling yourself up by your bootstraps. Which what, what does that even mean? Pull yourself up by your bootstraps. That is such an old phrase. I don't even know what that means anymore. What is that? What is a pull yourself up with the bootstraps? I know these boots used to be... Did they, boots used to have straps or something? Or did you... What does that mean? I don't even know what that means anymore. Whatever. Anyway, rambling now.